Hey Knitters, it's Wednesday. So, today has been a good day. Despite the fact that it's also been a very clumsy day for me, I accidentally shut my finger in a door at like 7.30 this morning and it still hurts. Um, I dropped my straight straightener on my toe. Thankfully it wasn't on um, this morning as well, so I've just been like running into stuff. I tripped coming up the stairs when I came home. Just like, what's going on? Anyways, um, random side note about stuff. Um, this is getting weird already. Okay. So this week I'm going to talk about crocheting because I've actually done some crocheting. Can you believe it? Um, I started working more on this mother bear that I have, um, just sitting around for a while. And I have the skirt here. It just needs to be attached. And then she needs a face and, um, a scarf. And then she will be done. And a tag, too. Um, so yeah, I actually did crocheting. Um, this past weekend, I started watching, um, Pushing Daisies. And so while I was watching that, um, I know I'm, like, way behind on that bandwagon. That show is, like, a million years old. Um, yeah. And I also, um, started watching Broadchurch, um, which is awesome. All the acting abilities. Britain has, like, six actors. Okay, I'm really spacey, I apologize. So the theme this week is a question that is kind of weird, but whatever. And the question is, when you were a kid, what did you most like to color with? Crayons, markers, or color pencils? And um, I am going to go with colored pencils, I guess. Um, mostly because they look the neatest. And I guess that's the perfectionist in me. I think colored pencils look the nicest when you color with them, um, but I think most kids probably enjoy markers, um, especially, like, teaching kindergarten, kindergartners love markers, um, but it's not usually something that we color with, like, every day. Crayons are cheaper, and they don't dry out, you don't have to worry about, you know, like, them drying out or anything like that. You don't have to sharpen them like, um, colored pencils, so crayons is the preferred method in kindergarten, um, but by the teachers anyway. Um, most kids would probably say markers are their favorite, and they get to color with markers sometimes, but everyday coloring kind of things, we use crayons. Um, yeah. That's my answer. I feel like I'm very low in the frame. I'm just gonna shrink away. Alright, other things. Um, I finally yesterday took a couple of pictures of my classroom that I'm going to, um, put at the end of this video, and they're not really, like, that great of pictures. I just kind of, like, quickly took them, um, on my way out the door. Um, and I did have one bulletin board that, at the beginning of the year, um, that had, like, a castle that I made, and a dragon, and a knight, and it said, like, welcome to kindergarten, and it had all the kids' names on it. Um, and I just took that down this week, um, because we're doing Chicka Chicka Boom Boom, which is a book about letters. Um, and like coconut trees and everything. So we may, um, in the picture you'll see one of the bulletin board has like a big chicka chicka boom boom tree and then each kid made their own little tiny chicka chicka boom boom tree and so we have like a chicka chicka boom boom forest and it turned out really cute. Um, but yeah, so I'm gonna insert a couple of pictures of my classroom here. Um, the comment I get most often about my classroom is how big it looks. Um, veteran teachers have a lot of stuff, and that tends to be very apparent in their classrooms. Um, most teachers I know are organized, but they just have a lot more stuff than I do since I'm a first year teacher. My room just looks kind of clean and basic because I don't have all this random stuff, um, but I like it that way. I, I like the not cluttered feeling and stuff. Um, and I really love my class and I love my job. I'm so glad I'm where I am. Like, kindergarten is, it's hard some days, but it's so rewarding and, um, yeah, I love it. Okay, so I guess I'm gonna go now. This video has been all over the place. I apologize. I hope that everyone is having an awesome week and I hope that Michael and Meira make videos this week because we miss your face. Okay, bye!